Hi guys, this is DMNC. Welcome to our channel. Subscribe and don't forget to the bell icon. I had to go through. Me and Rog both, I think, completely overreacted to. Brian May has opened up on losing Freddie Mercury and how he and Roger Taylor denied the existence of Queen for a while. It's been 30 years since Freddie Mercury died at just 45 years old. Following his death, Queen bandmates Brian May, Roger Taylor and John Deacon set about putting together their final album together in what would be 1995's Made in Heaven featuring the singer's posthumous vocals. At his album launch for the reissue of 1998's Another World, Brian May shared his emotional struggles with getting the record made and how he and the band came to terms with Freddie's untimely death. In the interview, Brian May said that Freddie Mercury's death affected Roger Taylor and himself. Speaking at the Royal Observatory, producer Simon Lupton asked Brian during a Q&A, Just before you made this album, you had been involved in making Made in Heaven with the rest of Queen. Going through that cathartic process of doing that, did that help when you went into another world or did it really not make much difference? Brian May said, Yeah, it did help, I think. It was something I had to go through. Me and Roger both, I think, completely overreacted to Freddie's death. If it's possible to say that, in other words, we went so far away along the path trying to forget that we overgrieved and we sort of denied the existence of Queen for a while. I certainly know I did. I think what I want to touch on is just before you made this album, you'd been involved in making Made in Heaven um, with, with the rest of Queen. Yeah. Um, was that, going through that cathartic process of doing that, did that help when you went into another world or did it really not make much difference? Yeah, it did help, I think. It's something I had to go through. Me and Rog both, I think, completely overreacted to Freddie's death, if it's possible to say that. In, in, in other words, we, we went so far away along the path of trying to forget that we, we overgrieved and, and we sort of denied the existence of Queen for a while. I, I, know, I certainly know I did. Um, so to come back and finally face it and put that final Queen album together, 